Hi, this is Professor Matt Regis from the Public Relations and Advertising Program. My name is Hui Lin. I am an associate professor in the School of Accountancy in the College of Business. My name is Carly Salas. I'm an instructor at the English Language Academy. I'm Matt Van Summer, and I'm an instructor with DePaul's English Language Academy and the Global Gateway Program. A typical class might have instructional videos might be using VoiceThread, which is a way for the teacher to allow students to leave voice messages for one another. My classes incorporate much of the same materials and practices and tasks that we would do in a face-to-face -face class. And we would be watching um, you know, recorded lectures, we would be watching short news programs, maybe documentaries. In our Zoom meetings, we have once a week, an hour, hour and a half. We have some uh, small group or whole class discussions. The students are really interactive with each other. They're speaking all the time. In an online environment, I think it's especially important to establish a sense of community, a sense of connectedness with the students, so the students feel engaged and motivated to do the work. What I can tell you about DePaul is all professors here have a deep commitment to a really personalized educational experience, and that doesn't matter if it's in the classroom, the personal attention that you'll receive You'll get to build uh, relationships with your instructors and with your classmates. I'm always trying to find creative ways to engage my students in an online class. In my undergraduate financial accounting class, I try to mimic the same problem-solving demonstration process that I would do in a face-to-face -face environment, where I use document camera or Excel, where I go through step-by-step -step detailed explanation about how to solve a particular problem. Sometimes I will find an interesting podcast for the students to listen to and discuss the content that is relevant to that week's material. My favorite part of teaching online is being able to have communication with my students. Sometimes I find that in the classroom, students are a little bit nervous to ask questions. I think the students are asking more questions uh, during a Zoom meeting because our time is limited. I think they want to take that opportunity to ask us questions. I'm getting a little bit more back and forth with the students about uh, what do I have to do for this presentation or, or can you help me with this aspect? There are definitely advantages from both teaching and learning perspectives when courses are delivered online. As a professor, if I'm not completely satisfied with my video lectures, I get to re-record them and add new examples. As a student, you get to re-watch the videos and solidify your understanding of the material. DePaul has a really unique learning situation. They have integrated D2L with Panopto, uh, which is video editing stuff, with VoiceThread, also with Zoom meetings. We don't just tell our faculty to teach online, we teach them how to teach online. Our multi-award winning and intensive online training program has prepared our faculty over the years on how to effectively and successfully teach online. The level of attention is unchanged, that students are still receiving very customized and personalized feedback and we're interacting. Chicago Chicago and DePaul is a very welcoming environment for international students and international scholars and I get a great pleasure from getting the opportunity to learn about other cultures and not just teach international students but also learn from you.